It's National Teen Driver Safety Week. So far, we've told you the leading causes of traffic crashes, common hazards young drivers face, as well as how to navigate bad weather and proceed if you're involved in an accident. Tonight, Sergeant Justin Dunn with Missouri State Highway Patrol tells you how parents and the heartland can help teens on the roads and make them safer overall. Obviously, we can't prepare them for everything that they're going to encounter when they get on the roadway. Um, a big thing that we always recommend, send them to a driver's education course if they can get to one of those. A lot of those are obsolete throughout the state anymore. Schools don't do those driver's education programs anymore, uh, but they do are still offered. You just may have to pay for your child to go. Along with driver's ed courses, Dunn says it all comes down to gaining experience. I know it's scary for those new drivers. We as parents, as their parents, we have to teach them the right way to do things. We have to get them time behind the wheel. Uh, you know, we have to progress through that progression as they start to drive, uh, meaning, you know, start them out in daytime driving, not very heavy traffic flow, and then start to move up to that heavier traffic flow. Make sure they're driving at nighttime so they get that experience. And then also with the inclement weather. I know we want to have control and don't want to really let go of the reins when it comes to that, but how are our kids going to get the experience unless we put them behind the wheel and let them navigate those type of situations? So we we have to get those kids behind the wheel um, at age 15. They can get a permit, get their permit as soon as they can, get them drive time, get hours logged so that they're getting as much experience as possible. As a community, the best thing we can do to keep our roads safe is follow all traffic laws. That's the number one thing, you know, follow all traffic laws, limit those distractions, always wear your safety belt, never drive impaired. That makes the roadway safer for everybody. You can do everything in your power to be the safest driver out there, but we also know that people aren't going to do that. So we have to spread awareness. We have to educate everybody um, so that we can make every day a safer day to be on Missouri's roadways. We've combined all the information and tips we've shared this week into one story online. You can find it by heading over to our website, ktvo.com.